Hello, Morlevis here. I'm back at my Wither Skeleton Testing Facilities slash little drop chamber thingamajig. And I was going to do some more testing with the Looting 3 enchantment versus Wither Skeleton and their skull drops. Uh, my last video, I got a comment from on host stating that there's been some changes in the recent update. So on 1.4.1, they I guess they made some changes to the Looting 3 enchantment and how it affects drops. So I figured I'd redo this test. Plus, I've made some changes to how I'm going to do this test, too, which should result in more accurate information. So what I'm going to do this time is I'm going to use a book to write down my results. And we also have a method of separating out the, the wither skeletons versus the regular skeletons. So I'm going to throw in... 64 into each of these dispensers, giving a total of 128 per test. And once they are done collecting, we will use a crusher system to kill off the regular skeletons, leaving just the wither skeletons behind. There we go. And then we will collect all the drops. Those ones are a little tricky to get sometimes. There we go. And then using our entity count, we will identify how many remaining skeletons are withers. So in this case, we have 97. I will then take this book, and I will write down that number 97. And then in the next slot, I will write down how many skulls I get. So I will switch to survival mode. I have one wither skull in my hotbar already. That is just so it remains visible during the test. And then I'll, I will do the exact same thing with the looting sword on the other side. There we go. So we got a total of two Wither Skulls because I had one to begin with. So I'll just update that. And then I will just get rid of everything. Reset my inventory. And do the same thing for the Looting Sword. Alright, so that time we got five, so I'm going to repeat this test a bunch more to get a little bit more data, and then we'll take a look at the results and see what we find out. And the results are in. I did a total of 19 tests per side. I actually thought I did 20, but I guess I miscounted. But anyway, here are the results. So, for the non-looting sword, got the individual tests here. Wither skeletons is the number on the left. The skull drops is the number on the right. So, the individual tests up to here give a total of 1,946 wither skeletons. And we got a total of 39 skulls, giving a drop rate of 2%. Moving on to the looting side, same deal. And we got a total of 1,933 wither skeletons, with a total of 68 skulls dropped, giving a drop rate of 3.52%.
So this is not definitive in any way, but these tests that I've done here seem to indicate that the looting three sword does increase the drop rate of the skulls by approximately 1.5%. Uh, the more tests I could do, the more accurate these results would be. But I hope this has been informative for you nonetheless, and that you enjoyed the video. Take care, and we'll see you next time.